Today I'm going to show you where the formatting marks are where you can check to see how many lines that you have in, in between on your paragraphs and I'm also going to show you how to insert and format the envelope. You're going to come up here to mailings and click on mailings then you will go to envelopes. Now remember the delivery address is where you are sending it. We are not sending it here. This is the return address. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to control X. I'm going to put that down here. You also need to take out the date and then put your name up in the top. Okay, now delivery, that's where it's actually going. We're going to type in the name and then the address. All right, now we want to format these two. So we're going to go to Options. Now for the envelope, you want all caps. So you have the delivery address and the return address. You're going to click on Font, All Caps. You can see it change it here. And then click OK. Then you go to the return address, All Caps, and then OK. Click OK when you're done. And then click Add to Document. and we do not so this is no we don't want that to be the default alright so now you can see they are both in caps what I want to do now is I want to center this on the page just so it will look better so I'm going to click on it I'm going to highlight my text I'm going to go to home I'm going to format this on my letter now it moves it over because here is our space up here at the top. If we want it totally centered on here, we can move this over this way and move this over this way. All right, and there's your format. We just need to move this over the top. Now, if you don't see this on your ruler, this is fine. We can leave it here. But if you do not see this, you're going to go to View and then click on Ruler. And Ruler will allow you to see this at the top. Now we want to center this one right here, only the top. So I'm going to only select this. Now, if I come here and I try to center it, look what happens. Well, that is because my right margin is way over here. We don't want that. So what we're going to do is we're going to move this margin. Be sure that you have everything selected to about right here. That encompasses all of it. And now it is centered. See, you have now moved your margin. Now, we want to check our formatting to see that we have the right number of spaces in our document and that is right here. You can see where the section break is on your envelope. Every time you see one of these marks you have hit the enter button. We have a quadruple space here. We have single spaces in between each one of these. We hit the enter button one time and then we have a double space right here. You see it twice. Don't forget to check these to make sure this is correct. You should have a quadruple space between this address and this address double space in between these your your body text will be single space and then you have a quadruple space after the complimentary close where you put your name don't forget this is where you would actually sign right here in the signature block which is why you have a quadruple space at the bottom if you have any questions please let me know